In the Red Lodge area, there's always one telltale sign that the weather is beginning to change. This chain right here locking the Beartooth Pass for the year after what has been a successful summer season. Admittedly, Jody Ronning's timing couldn't have been worse. We started this and I quit my job right during COVID. That bold decision to open up her own business called Market 5555 in downtown Red Lodge was greeted by a worldwide pandemic. A lot of turmoil, a lot of uncertainty. And that proved only to be the beginning. And then the next year we had the fire where Mount Maurice burned down and, you know, they evacuated town right up to um, the forest station. Then, of course, 2022 was the floods. Suddenly, Ronning's business was three years old and still struggling. Your first five years in a business kind of is a make or break. And when three of those years are so uncertain and so awful, you know, you, you really do kind of rethink your, your choices. And she wasn't alone. The business is and the community depend on our visitors. Red Lodge Area Chamber of Commerce Director Sherry Weimer says three straight summers of devastation had many fearing the worst. There's no way we could have all the great restaurants and other shops we do downtown without them. But this year, Mother Nature had this mountain town's back. With the Beartooth Pass staying open until mid-October, a rarity that wasn't taken for granted in town. Typically, there's a storm that comes in and closes it down a little early, but we were so lucky this year. Every day was kind of a bonus. You know, this is what a real summer's supposed to look like. You know, much better sales than we'd had the prior three summers. A big relief for Ronning, who knows how desperately her business needed some normal. I would not be here without the tourists. You know, I really wouldn't. In Red Lodge, Charlie Kleps, MTN News.